Helicopters are fascinating. Their downside, however, is the noise impact. DLR researches this issue on one of the largest types of helicopter. This helicopter is a military aircraft. It's the CH-53 of the Bundeswehr Technical Center for Aircraft. Typically, helicopter noise results from the rotor blade tip vortices colliding with rotor blades. It's extremely difficult to detect and minimize this effect. Large rotor blades are especially challenging. The Department of Helicopter Aerodynamics at the German Aerospace Center in Göttingen investigates at the DLR Research Airport in Braunschweig how to mitigate vortices of rotor blades. A world first. We rarely work with airborne aircraft. Here, for the first time, we optically measured these vortices that play a key role in helicopter noise, vibration and performance. What do the measurements of optical density, position tracking and flow velocity reveal? What's the nature of the air flows at the blade tips and in the blade wakes? This optical technique is amazing because it uses ordinary cameras to study rotor blade tip vortices, not thermal imaging cameras or laser-based technology. Here we merely record a random dot pattern positioned behind the helicopter and use the subtle image deformations to reveal the vortices. You cannot totally eliminate these blade tip vortices, but there have been improvements in recent years in terms of new rotor blade geometries that we then have to tweak using aeroelasticity, aerodynamics and structural mechanics. But these vortices will always be there and we'll always have to study them to minimize their impact. Delicate maneuvers hovering just above the ground. Every lift generating surface creates the problem of pressure equalization at its tips between the upper and lower sides and this creates intense turbulence. A helicopter is constantly flying into its own wake vortices created at the rotor blade tips. This is a problem for the incoming rotor blades. They interact, generate noise, vibrations, stall and so on. The research goals are clear. They have to measure and analyze both the vortex interactions of the rotor blades and the turbulence generated by the blade tips. An ambitious goal. This paves the way for future helicopter innovations. DLR works hand in hand with the industry by developing computer programs. And here we compile validation data for these program developers. So our precise aerodynamic data are used to further develop, calibrate, adjust and optimize computer programs. And these programs go to the European helicopter industry so they can develop improved aircraft, rotor blade tips and so on. And this makes helicopters quieter and vibrate less than they did in the old days. These new data allowed researchers to come one step closer to turning loud choppers into quiet, majestic flying machines making helicopters quieter, safer and more comfortable. The work of the German Aerospace Center in Göttingen plays an essential role in achieving this goal.